Hi, I'm Michael Isaac Salai, um, and I lead business development at IES for the EMEA region. And my name is Mike Follett, I'm the CEO of Lumen, the attention technology company. Well, I think there's been an awful lot of progress that we've made in the last 10 years, trying to understand the opportunity to see at whether or not they're viewable or not, or if they're just there on the screen. But the opportunity to see things isn't the same as necessarily looking at them. And now we're coming to an understanding that there's quite a big difference between what people could see and what they do see. That means that the, the topic of attention has suddenly become much more interesting. I think we're, you know, at a learning phase. I think, you know, we've for the last year, we've been doing a lot of research trying to understand what our advertisers want when talking about attention, and we've tried to build a product that sort of plays into that. Um, and you know, a lot of that is based off a lot of what we kind of already had in house, you know, things to do with viewability and time in view, so on and so forth. And I think the missing piece, something that we did not have any um, visibility into, was, was was the human element. And as a result of that, I think being able to sort of mesh those things together and bring a product to market has been really exciting. But I think we're only at the start of the journey and so I think the, the product's only gonna evolve further as time goes on. Sure, I think the partnership is a really, really exciting, you know, next step for us. I think we understand that viewability only goes so far. The next step is to go deep and I think attention was that. I mentioned, you know, taking time to really understand it. And, um, you know, look, there's, there's lots of stuff that we could do. I think, you know, in another world, we could have decided to go out and build a product on our own. But I think we understood that insofar as what our advertisers wanted, that wouldn't have really served the purpose. We needed the human element. And I think, you know, talking with Mike, I think the first conversation was at Cannes last year. And ever since then, it was really clear that, you know, we wanted to sort of, you know, partner with a company that was as innovative, but also well-placed in the market in order to be, <laughs> I know, I know. Um, you know, so well placed in the market in order to be able um, for us to, to, to create a, pr a product that we, we genuinely believe will be able to answer a lot of questions um, and tie it to not just fluffy stuff, but you know, real outcomes. Yeah, I mean, a lot of our clients have been saying that our data is really interesting, but we are a small, growing fast, but still from a, a small base. So it's a, a tremendously important for us to partner with a company of the scale and authority as, as IES to deliver something that clients are really asking for. So for us, it's a tremendously exciting opportunity to sort of democratise attention. I think, you know, we, we take it in steps, right? We, um, you know, we're at, at this point in time, we're working really hard to integrate Lumen's data, you know, mesh that with ours. The first sort of guise of this will be in, you know, post-bid measurement. We need to understand and measure attention in a, in a really, you know, clear and concise way, in a way that, again, our advertisers are asking us for. We want to be able to build um, you know, a um, you know, b build a report that will actually be able to, you know, decipher attention in the way that our, our advertisers want as well. And then the next step after that is to be able to use the data that we've collected over the last however many months, and then put that into into pre-bid segments um, in order to have optimizable attention. Yeah. I think there's uh, uh, the first step is is the measurement of what happened in the past. The next step is predicting what's going to happen in the future. Yeah. And for us, already, talking getting the tech teams to work together, the first bit is pretty easy to do. Mm -hmm. But what's really exciting is actually how easy the second step is. Yeah. You know, the, these pre-big segments, make it leveraging the scale of IES with the, the insights that we get from the uh, Lumen Attention data, that's the really exciting thing. Yeah. It's my first interact and I'm really enjoying it. Um, it's great to see some some old friends, some some random people that I've kind of worked uh, worked with, um, you know, in, in past lives, and be able to bump into them. So that's been lovely. And Madrid is a gorgeous city. Not spent enough time here. In terms of the event in itself, um, really enjoyed Taylor's presentation with P and G. Thought it was really enlightening. Um, in order to see what they're doing, especially with the creative element, it's not really something we work with so much as IES. So for me, that's just really, really sort of interesting to see. 
And I've just been really impressed by the seniority uh, of the attendees and the, and the quality of the thought. So often at conferences like this, you just have people just pitching their book. Whereas here, you have a real debate from real leaders, and uh, I find that really fascinating. Thank you.